Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, I will keep my remarks very brief this evening. I've been given the great honour to bring this evening's event to a close. Tonight we heard the term trailblazer used many times, and it reminded me of the words of a great statesman, the 26th President of the United States and the 1906 Nobel Peace Prize winner, Theodore Roosevelt, who in 1910 in Sorbonne, Paris, said the following, Far better it is to dare mighty things, to win glorious triumphs, even though checkered by failure, than to rank with those poor spirits who neither enjoy nor suffer much, because they live in the grey twilight that knows not victory nor defeat. This place, this parliament, from 1997 to today, has indeed dared mighty things. Can I especially thank the partners of the Armenian National Committee of Australia, who through their steadfast support, allows our organisation to soar to new heights each and every year. I'm delighted to announce that through the steadfast support of our community, our office has grown from a full-time executive director to four permanent staff in our office. Can I also thank those who have come before us and who continue in advocating issues of importance to the Armenian community here in Australia. To many who are in this room and many who couldn't be with us tonight, the likes of Vaskian Pailagian, Trokortian, Varant Magardichian, Viken Kalohian and many others, who through many decades have fearlessly advocated for the just recognition of the Armenian genocide. And especially tonight, can I thank a generation of community activists who planted the seeds for grassroots who planted the seeds for grassroots advocacy in our community over five decades ago. And tonight I want to especially pay tribute to one individual, Mr. Hago Kortian, a founding member of the Armenian National Committee of Australia over five decades ago, who sadly passed away last week with the dream of one day seeing Australia add its voice to joining New South Wales in the recognition of the Armenian Genocide. To members of this place, both past and present, thank you for your unwavering and steadfast support. May you continue to have the courage to continue to dare mighty things. Thank you and good night.